Now, Mr. President, I graciously approve that the comprehensive work of 11 kilometers by two carriageways, and of course, each carriageway consists of about four lanes. It will be done, and the Honorable Minister has directed that uh, you know, money be released immediately. And so we're doing that, and then we're going to uh, change all the light to solar. We are going to put uh, CCTV, both under the bridge and on top of the bridge. We are remarking the uh, finished work, and uh, of course, we are also painting the curbs. So it's going to be a classic, uh, you know, beautiful, inserted bridge where we finish. And it's been done by CCACC. I can say that I've done over 30%. We are looking at March April to complete that work. And we apologize to negotiators and Nigerians for any inconveniences they would have noticed. But it's also for their own safety, because should we allow the bridge to be the way it is, uh, it is overturning that they could be skidding and all kinds of accidents. So we don't want that to happen. The Minister of Finance, Wale Adun, who was part of the inspection tour of the project, says the federal government is committed to funding them to ensure speedy completion. It's always important that one answers the question that is asked. Where will we find the money? The number one place is the changes that were made, the hemorrhaging that was stopped in terms of the spending that was wasteful and that was only benefiting a small minority in terms of the 2% of GDP that was spent on fuel subsidy. That was the number one leakage that was stopped. But in addition, we have to encourage NMPC and all the security forces at a time of high oil prices to push up oil production and oil sales. And in between that, there is a whole range of improvements, digitization, uh, computerization, application of technology and systems to ensure that what is due to the government on behalf of the people of Nigeria is not going into a few pockets, it is coming into the common pocket. What we are committing to and we are targeting and working towards is a 77% increase in internally generated revenue for the federal government. So there, is where the funding particularly is going to come from. 